Now, the Oregon Health Authority says the number of people who got sick after eating at Chipotle is growing. They say they have now confirmed 12 cases of E. coli around the state, and they're expecting more. Cor Harlan has the latest on this outbreak. Well, good afternoon, uh, Ken and uh, Jenny. Uh, we understand now Chipotle Restaurants has closed 14 Portland area stores. In response to this, increasing number of E. coli cases have been either confirmed or are probabilities here in the testing that they've done in the last several days. And we also learned from our news briefing this morning here at the Oregon Health Authority that uh, people are beginning to report similar symptoms, bloody diarrhea and severe diarrhea, in Columbia, Benton, even Deschutes County in Central Oregon. So far by the numbers have been no deaths as a result of this, but three people have been hospitalized with E. coli symptoms. The health authority now says that people who ate at a Chipotle restaurant in the Portland area after October the 8th could be at risk of developing symptoms here. We're told typically they take about three to four days to materialize after eating, but they can take as long as 10 days, and they do expect that number, as we mentioned, to grow. Meanwhile, the uh, federal government is also involved here. Food samples have been collected from the restaurants in question here. They're now at an FDA testing lab in the Seattle area, testing foods that have been collected from Chipotle restaurants. The fact that Chipotle restaurants throughout the region are affected means that it isn't likely that it's something happening in a single store, like a sick food handler, but rather some product that is coming um, through distribution or from a farm uh, that is uh, affected with this or contaminated and that then gets distributed through Chipotle restaurants. And we also asked today, wanted to know exactly what food source this might actually be. And they say it's far too early to say for sure. They have said it's not likely uh, something that came from meat or chicken. Uh, but more uh, precisely, they are focusing now on any vegetables, lettuce, tomatoes, even cilantro that may have been uh, distributed through Chipotle restaurants. Jenny and Ken.